Dear friends, in this video I will be telling you how to write a notice. Already in online class I taught you, I explained you how to write notice. The format of uh, writing notice is given in page number 163 of your textbook. Now you can take a book and see in page number 163, 163 how to write a notice. And we have to very clearly follow the instruction given uh, in the book, otherwise you don't get any mark. So it is very important to follow the instruction. See, first is given like name of the organization, institution, office issuing the or a notice. And a for uh, example is given, a specimen is given bottom. Just below that, a specimen is given like modern public school. Name of the organization, institution, like modern public school. So first we are right here, when if you are writing notice in your school, like St. Thomas School, then you must write like this, St. Thomas Higher Secondary School. St. Thomas Higher Secondary School. I have already given you. In uh, school portal, I have sent uh, two or three notices I have given. You should copy all those notices in your notebook and study them well. So first, the title of the institution. Then below that, as it is given in the book, see, notice. That must be in capital letter. Notice. N-O-T-I-C-E. Must be in capital letter. Notice is given there. That should be the middle part. Then after that, what should be given? Heading. See, here it is given name of the organization, institution, then notice in capital letter, then heading. And in specimen it is given, modern public school. Here you will write, St. Thomas Higher Secondary School as I have written. Then notice in capital letter at right. Then the subject, the heading should be about what you are going to give the notice. Uh, I think I have given you all the three in next page, page number 164. There are three notices. One, uh, you lost your, uh, you found a geometry box in the playground and you got it. And uh, you are publishing a notice in the school notice board. I already gave you in the school order. Then second one, organizing for a children's fair on teacher's day. Then also I sent you in the school order. The heading is given already there. Then third one, that you are organizing, your school is organizing a tour to Jodhpur during holidays. That also I gave you and see the heading where they are given. And here in the specimen is given inter-class debate competition. Like here, inter-class debate or inter-class inter inter-class debate inter-class or C competition. I capital, C capital, D capital, and then competition C capital. That is the way that we write the heading. Then after that, here is your date of issue. The day on which you are writing the notice. On that, that day, like a today's date is uh, 25 today, the day, day when I am recording this video. 25. So you get the margin. Here you will write, suppose so this is the margin then. Uh, two ways of writing the day. The best way to write is like this uh, what is the month? Uh, so August. So August 25 March 2021. Like that you may write the date. Then the body should be very short. After that, the content that is given here, date of issue, the content. That should be very short and sweet. And here you have to mention what is happening, where it is happening, when it is happening, at what time precisely. Everything should be given. 
So everything must be very clear in the notice. Nothing should be vague. A person who is reading the notice should understand that where something is happening, at what time it will be happening, and which day it will, on which day it is happening, and at what time precisely. Like you are reading a notice or invitation card for the marriage. Where the marriage will take place, will take place, and when on which date it will happen, and time of arrival till when. Everything is given very specifically. The same way you also should be writing the notice, a very short notice, but it should be given uh, what, all the ideas very precisely and clarification must be there. Then after that, if you want to hear signature is given, then uh, your name. Signature that name, your name must be in full. And with your surname you have to write the designation of the person right in the notice. Like if you are a head boy, head girl, or monitor, uh, something like that, you have to write the designation. Here you have to your signature content, the body must be here. Then towards the end, here on the left side, you have to put your signature, then write your name, full name, then your designation. Designation means what designation you have. Whether you are a monitor of the class, you are a head boy of the class, you are a head girl of the class, then that should be mentioned. So this is what a notice is. And I have given you already the uh, three examples I have given. Okay, thank you. Yeah,